Hello friends, hello. I'm so glad you're here with me today. It's another beautiful morning and I hope you're feeling good. Give me two thumbs up if you're feeling really good. Awesome, I hope you're feeling great. I hope you're having a beautiful morning. We are going to have such a good time together friends because we get to taste cherries today. Friends, have you ever had a cherry before? Did you know that a cherry has a seed in the middle? So you have to be extra careful when you eat that cherry, okay? Do you like cherries if you've tried them? Do you like them? Are you a cherry person or, mm, I don't know, Miss Shannon or, nah, Miss Shannon, definitely, I don't like cherries. What do you think? All right, friends, I think cherries are pretty yummy. I eat them often. They're a really yummy fruit and they're good for you to eat. And we are gonna talk a little bit more about them. And so before we get started, friends, I want you to give me two thumbs up if you are ready to get started. One, two, ready, Miss Shannon. All right, let's begin. I'm going to grab my trusty purple pointer and we'll begin. Good morning, boys and girls. Today is July 14th, 2021. There are 14 days so far in the month of July. Let's spell July and count. J-U-L-Y, July. One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, and fourteen. Let's see what the number fourteen looks like, friends. The number fourteen has a one and a four. Fourteen. Let's stick it right there up on the board. And we know that today is what day, friends? Wednesday. If you said Wednesday, you are correct. Let's grab our Wednesday sign. Wednesday starts with a W. We're going to put Wednesday on the board. And of course, we have to sing our song. Are you ready? Today is Wednesday. Today is Wednesday. All day long. All day long. Today is Wednesday. Today is Wednesday. All day long, all day long. Today is Wednesday. Happy, happy Wednesday. Happy, happy Wednesday. All right, friends, since we know that today is Wednesday, what was yesterday? Yesterday we tried purple grapes. Do you remember? Mm -hmm. And yesterday was Tuesday. If you said Tuesday, you are correct. Good job, friends. Let's sing. Today is Wednesday. Yesterday was Tuesday. Today is Wednesday. Yesterday was Tuesday. Today is Wednesday. All right, friends, let's look at these. Today is Wednesday and yesterday was Tuesday. What will tomorrow be? Did someone say Thursday? You guys are so smart, so intelligent. Tomorrow is Thursday. Let's spell Thursday. T-H-U-R-S-D-A-Y, Thursday. And we'll put Thursday right here on the board. All right, friends, since we know our days of the week, we are going to sing about them too. Are you ready? Let's put seven fingers in the air and we use our fingers to move our finger muscles because it might be early in the morning, right? Or if you're watching in the afternoon, whatever time you're watching, we should get some exercise, especially with our fingers. So we're going to count and we're going to sing. Are you ready? Days of the week. 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 There's Sunday and there's Monday, there's Tuesday and there's Wednesday, there's Thursday and there's Friday, and then there's Saturday, days of the week, days of the week, days of the week, days of the week, days of the week. How many months are in a year? Did someone say 12? 
If you said 12, you are correct. Are you ready? These are the months of the year. There's January, February, March, April, May, June, July, August, September, October, November, December. These are the months of the year. Good job, friends. These are the months in the year. There are 12. So since we can't count 12 on 10 fingers, how are we going to do that? We have to add 10 and 2 is 12. All right, friends, we are going to talk about the season. Let's talk about what season we're in. We are currently in the summer season, friends. And what happens in the summer? What happens, friends? Is it cold or is it hot? It's definitely hot. And should we go snow diving or swimming? Definitely swimming, right? We can't play in the snow in summer. That'd be so silly, right, friends? In the summertime, the sun is out, right? It's shining. The leaves on the trees are green. We can play in water, right? We see beautiful flowers all around. Do you have a garden where you have flowers? Or have you seen flowers? Yes, that happens in the summer, in the summer season. All right, friends, now we're going to talk about the weather. Let's take a look at the weather. It's hot, friends. It is the summer season, and in the summer season, it stays hot. It does. H-O-T, hot. And let's take a look at Mr. Dinosaur. He has on my favorite sunglasses. Friends, do you like wearing sunglasses? Do you like it? Do you think it's cool wearing sunglasses? Well, not only is it cool, friends, but it helps your eyes. If you're out in the sun, the glasses protect your eyes, right? And so does a, a, a hat. So if you wear a hat and you have on your sunglasses, you are keeping your head in shade, right? And it's really, really good idea to wear both of them on a hot day. And friends, let me ask you, do you have a beach ball? Do you have one? If you go out to the beach, you can play in the sand, right? Wouldn't it be really fun to have a beach ball and you can throw it up, right? Maybe play with some friends. Yes, beach balls are really cool. All right, friends, it's time for us to dance and jump up and down and all around. We made it here today with Miss Shannon. Are you guys ready? I know you are. Okay, who's up first? Whenever I call on my friends, I always let the ladies, right, or the girls go first. So if you are a girl and you're here with Miss Shannon, I want you to say, I'm here, Miss Shannon, and we're going to jump up and down and all around. Are you ready? Are you ready? Okay, my girls are up first. Are my girls here today? Are my girls here today? I jump up, down, and all around. My girls are here today. Hooray. My girls are here today. All right, girls, you did amazing. Now it's time for the boys. Boys, are you ready? Are you ready to jump up and down and all around? Are you ready? If you are a boy, I want you to raise your hand and say, Miss Shannon, I'm ready. All right, let's dance. Are my boys here today? Are my boys here today? I jump up. Down and all around, my boys are here today. My boys are here today. All right, next up is Miss Shan's turn. I need you guys to help me. Yes, can you help me, please? All right, boys and girls, stand up if you can. If you want to sit, that's okay too. We're going to dance together. Is Miss Shannon here today? Is Miss Shannon here today? I jump up, down, and all around. Miss Shannon is here 
today, hooray, I made it today with my friends. All right, friends, now that we're dancing, we're going to keep moving. Before we read our story, we're going to sing, dance, and exercise a little bit. So if you are ready, I want you to say, ready, Miss Shannon. Do you guys know the song, Do You Like Ice Cream? Yes, I do. Yes, I do. So Miss Shannon's going to sing that to you. I'm going to choose ice cream, maybe some fruits carrots and then something silly are you ready to sing it with me all right do you like cherries do you like cherries yes i do yes i do do you like kiwi do you like kiwi yes i do yes i do do you like bananas do you like bananas yes i do Yes, I do. Friends, do you like strawberries on pizza? <gasps> no, I don't. Mm, strawberries on top of a pizza? Oh, no, I don't like that. All right, friends, we'll sing one more song. Are you ready? If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, and your face will surely show it. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, stomp your feet. If you're happy and you know it, stomp your feet. If you're happy and you know it, and your face will surely show it. If you're happy and you know it, stomp your feet. If you're happy and you know it, shout hooray, hooray. If you're happy and you know it, shout hooray, hooray. If you're happy and you know it, and your face will surely show it. If you're happy and you know it, shout hooray, hooray. Now we're going to do all three together. Are you ready? If you're happy and you know it, do all three. Hooray. If you're happy and you know it, do all three. Hooray! If you're happy and you know it, and your face will surely show it. If you're happy and you know it, do all three. Hooray! Good job, friends. Give yourself a clap and a pat on the back. Give yourself a squeeze. Pretend it's Miss Shannon giving you a hug. You guys are amazing. Great job, friends. We are now going to start on our story. Don't forget to grab your drink of water if you need it, right? Grab your water. Cool down a bit. Maybe you don't need water, right? That's okay too. But if you do, take your drink of water, take a deep breath, and we'll get started on our story. Ooh, today's story. We have another story, right, from our series. We are going to read, I am not sleepy. Friends, can I talk to you for a minute? Guess what? In the summertime, sometimes friends don't like to sleep, right? We don't like to go to sleep in the summer. Why? Hmm, I don't know. What do you think? Do you think it's because we go to bed early all during the school year? And when it comes to the summer, we don't want to sleep early at all. We want to stay up late. Do you think that's it? I'm not sure. What do you think? Do you like to stay up late or do you like to go to sleep? Which one? Well, we are going to read the story together and see. I am not sleepy. I am not sleepy. Well, maybe I'm a little sleepy. <laughs> Do I have to clean up my toys? That looks like fun. Let me help. I don't want to take a bath. Hi, Ducky. I love taking baths with you. <laughs> no pajamas. Oh, I want to wear the soft rainbow ones. Is she changing her mind? Mm -hmm. No, I don't want to brush my teeth. Look, I can brush my teeth all by myself. Yawn. No singing, please. The itsy bitsy spider went up the water spout. 
I know this song, I'll sing it. Down came the rain and washed the spider out. Friends, is she supposed to be getting ready for bed? <laughs> no story, I want to jump. Read that part again, please, mama. I don't want to wear a bonnet. I don't want my pretty hair to get messy. May I have my bonnet, mama? No kisses. Mama, come back. One more kiss, please. It's too dark, mama. Mmm, this is just bright. Mama, my baby. Ah, here she goes. Good night, sweet girl. Nope, I am not sleepy. <laughs> the end. Friends, what do you notice? Can you tell me what you notice in the story? Do you notice a little girl who's still saying in her sleep, maybe in her mind, I'm still not sleepy, but is she sleeping? It looks like it. Friends, was she doing everything else but going to sleep? Yup. Do you wonder if she does that all the time? Do you think that happens every night she doesn't want to go to bed? Do you like going to bed early? Or do you go to bed right away when mommy says it's time to go to bed? What happens? <laughs> right? Sometimes we don't want to go to bed, but it's healthy for our bodies to get plenty of rest, right? So we have to make sure at night when we're all tucked in, right? And we, we're laying on our pillow and we're fast asleep that we get plenty of rest so that we can feel good in the morning. I hope you guys enjoyed this story. All right, friends, we are going to get started on our painting. Are you ready? Today, we get to paint cherries. So I'm going to move my easel over so you guys can see it and you can join in with me as we paint together. But first, before we paint, what do we have to do? We have to taste the cherries. Mmm, how do cherries taste? Let's see. Here's my bowl of cherries. Do you think the cherries are sweet or sour? What do you think, friends? Hmm, let's see. Mmm, I think the cherries are sweet. My cherries are super sweet. Can you see, friends? Can you see the stem? I'm gonna try another piece. Mmm. Look, friends, it came right off the stem. And don't forget, a cherry, friends, has a seed in the middle. So you have to be very careful. See the seed that's in the middle? You have to make sure that you don't eat that part, right? You can put that part to the side. You don't want to eat that because it's very hard. That's the inside of the cherry, okay? Friends, take a look at Miss Shannon's cherries. What do you notice? Do you notice that one of my cherries, what color is it? It's like a deep, deep, dark purple. And what color is my other cherry? It's red. I have two different colors. Yeah, sometimes that happens. It's a purple cherry and a red cherry. And look at the stem, friends. Can you see the stem? It's green and a little brown, right? Oh, yeah. Okay, are you still eating more cherries? I really like cherries. I can eat so many more cherries. Mm -hmm. And now we are going to get started on our painting. So you can keep eating your cherries if you would like. I'm going to get my paint supplies ready. I'm going to use red, and then we can also add a little purple, right? Just like Miss Shannon's cherry 
was purple, one was purple, one was red. All right, friends. And we also need green or brown for our stem and our leaf. Sometimes, friends, if you have a bunch of cherries together, you may see a leaf on that cherry, okay, on the stem. So this part here is the long stem, and then at the bottom, you will see the cherry, just like how we looked at it a few minutes ago. All right, just like that. And cherries are yummy. They're really, really sweet. All right, so I'm going to start at the top. I want to start with my leaf. Okay, so I am going to take out my paint palette. I have all my colors here. All right, I'm going to dip my brush in some water. All right. And once my paintbrush is wet, I'm going to use green to color in my leaf. All right, friends. So I'm just gonna start right up here, just like that. Okay. And then we're going to make sure our leaf is green. Nice and green. Friends, do you think it's okay to eat the leaf or the stem of the cherry? What do you think? You think it's all right? You think it's okay? Mm -mm, right? It's very hard. And so that part isn't edible, right? We shouldn't eat that part. We're just eating the bottom. Okay. There we have it. All right. <laughs> How is your leaf looking? We're starting with our leaf. Remember, you can go over it as many times as you would like because the more you paint over it, friends, the darker the color will get, okay? All right, and I'll go ahead and make the top of my stem green as well. Okay, and then I'll come out to the sides just a little bit. There we have it. And then we can make our stem green. We can use brown as well. And then of course, for the cherries, those are red, right? Okay. How does yours look? Is it coming along really good? I know it looks awesome. Shannon knows that her artists are doing a really awesome job. I just know it. <laughs> All right, next I'm going to use brown. Okay, friends? I'm going to use brown and I always like to show you the colors that I'm using. So as I'm using brown, I'm going to just go down my stem just like this. And yours can be brown and green, just brown. It's up to you. Okay. However you'd like to paint it. <laughs> I'm also going to add a little bit of green too, okay? I'm gonna add some green so that you can see the green and brown, okay? So far so good, friends? How are you doing? How does it look? Are you happy with your artwork? All right, okay. I'm just gonna come down just a tad, just like this. Right there, we have it. Our stem is painted and our leaf. Okay, all right, friends. Now that I have my brush back into my water, I am going to use red and I'm also going to use a little purple as well. Okay, both red and purple for my two cherries. Okay, so first up is my red color. 
red is such a pretty color. Look at that, friends. And I'm going to start right up here. Just like that. And I'm going to go over all the edges of my cherry. Okay. Then I'm going to come down until my entire cherry is filled up, okay? All right, and remember, a little paint goes a long way. It really does. It means if we just put a little bit on the brush, it can go a very long way. All right? Okay. There we have it. And now... I'm just going to dab my paintbrush in the red a little bit more as I go toward the bottom. And don't forget to get the edge of your cherry and just come all the way around <laughs> like that. Okay. And then we'll go around again. I'm almost there, but I want to check on you. How are you doing, friends? How are you doing? Are you doing great? Good. Friends, did you know that there are about a thousand, a little bit more than a thousand types of cherries? So there are different varieties of cherries, more than a thousand. Can you believe it? Oh my goodness. So we are painting red cherries, right? but there are a, a thousand different type of cherries. I think that's amazing, right? Isn't that incredible? <laughs> All right. Now we're going to go to the other side and I'm going to continue to use red because once I finished painting, the cherry red, I'll also add a little bit of purple as well, okay? All right, my cherry is coming along. I hope it looks good for you guys too. I'm sure it does. Take your time, okay? Don't worry, even if you're not as far as Miss Shannon, just take your time, right? This is your artwork. You are making it special. You are making it beautiful, okay? All right, here we are. We're coming around and we're going up, making sure we get all those edges. And I'm just gonna leave a little part of it white because I want to fill in um, some of that space, friends, with a little purple, right? Just like the cherry we just looked at, one was purple, it was really dark, all right? So I'm just gonna leave a couple of those spaces in my cherry purple, okay? And I'm going to dip my brush in my water, dry it off a little bit, and then I'm going to use purple. And purple is my favorite color, I love purple. <laughs> All right, friends, so we are going to make our cherries look really nice and yummy as if we could eat them, but we can't eat the cherries on the paper, right? No, Miss Shannon, that's just for pretend. All right, so I'm adding my purple. Okay, so I have some purple on my brush and I'm just going to go right up here and I'm going to come down just a little bit right here and then I'll make my way around to just add in a little purple so that my cherry is purple a little and red. Let's see. Ooh, friends, look how that's turning out. All right, my cherry is coming along. As it dries, I'm also going to add just a little bit more. I'll add some, fill in some spaces there. Look, oh, can you see Miss Shannon's cherries? How does yours look? I know it looks awesome. I'm just gonna add a little bit more there, 
just like that. All right, friends. I hope you had a great time creating this with me. I am all finished. If you're still painting, keep going, okay? You are an amazing artist. Don't worry about rushing. I know you can do it. I'll see you right back here tomorrow, okay? We're gonna have fun again. I can't wait to taste our next fruit. It's going to be yummy. Remember friends, you are awesome. You are intelligent and you are amazing. I want you to tell yourself that as well. I am awesome. I am intelligent. I am amazing, right? Don't forget it. See you back here tomorrow. Bye, friends.